That's how the Batman <laughs> died. <laughs> a hit and run accident. And we're back. We're back. Still hiding. Around the corner. Yeah. Bring hell. Oh, more tanks. Oh, there's an unlimited supply, it seems. Of unmanned drones. Yep. Oh, hey, look. One just popped pop around the corner. Easy at the moment. Yeah. Bang. So I've got a critical point where that lights lighters don't yeah. you? Yeah. Right. You don't find that out until later. I don't know <laughs> why. But like they tell you, oh I need to aim for here. And you're like, well I've pretty well already worked that out. I've played video games in general before. Yeah, whoops, missed that. Yeah. Terrible shot. Well, there goes your hundred percent hit rate. Start the game again. Yeah, oh no, my KD's out. <laughs> For those of you who okay. don't know me, that are watching this, I am such a Batman fan. Jim, I love everything. Yeah, you are. You're crazy. I mean, <coughs> in this room we're sitting in right now, Terry's Land room, we've got a framed photo of the Joker above the TV, the Heath Ledger Joker. To Terry's right, there is the... Um, Special pre-order Batman statue. statue that came with Arkham Knight that lights up and shit. Yeah. For, further to the right is the one that came with Arkham Origins. City. Arkham City, sorry. Yeah, and then next to that's the Arkham Origins. Yeah. Joker with the TVs that all lights up. Above that is the um, Death of the Family Collector's Edition. That's right. With the Joker's Joker's mask in it. See, I don't even need a. So, I don't even need to remember because he's memorized the layout of where all these things are. <laughs> yeah, I'm still watching. I'm watching the TV, just going like, "Oh yeah, next to that's this, and then standing next to that's that." And yeah, I've even got one of those um, figs, like a, a supermarket here, Wool Woolworths, used to sell these little action figures. They have little oh, chips in them. The fruit. No, 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 no. Not, not, I'm not an old person. <laughs> But uh, you say you have an app on your phone and you can take a photo of it and it'll bring the superhero to life or oh, that sort nice. of thing. Oh, is that what that is? I did yeah. see that over there the other day. I got, day. I I got oh, the that's Batman all. version of that and it's not even open. I just <laughs> I kept it in the box. I don't know why. It's not going to be worth anything, but... Hmm. <clears throat> I'm an absolute fucking fanatic. I love it, but... This game has so many awesome scenes that call back to the most iconic Batman stories. Yeah, just we saw a few of those yesterday. That was um confrontal. Fucking jaw dropping. Scarecrow's gonna break you, Batman. She looks like Rebecca Romaine. Why do you even? I don't know who that is. Um, oh, Mystique from X Men. We don't have the manpower or the. But not done in the blue. Lawrence. No. Um, sorry, the first X Men films. Oh, Jennifer yeah. Lawrence. <laughs> sorry, it's the only one I pay attention to. No, that's for First Class and Days of Future Past shit all over the first trilogy. Although the second one was really good. First and second X-Men films were really good. Gee, the, and then the there Deadpool's was... Deadpool's going to make an appearance in the next X-Men. I think it is. Really? Or Wolverine. It might be Wolverine. Either or. I no, know, it I would have to be... I know it's going to be um, Hugh Jackman's last yeah. last depiction of Wolverine. But... Being Apocalypse, it would have to be Wolverine because of the Four Horsemen. Okay. Um, for those of you who don't know... Next X Men film is Apocalypse, and Apocalypse is a big, big, big bad in the X Men universe. Am Apocalypse, pretty much. Um, the first mutant. One of the yeah, believed to be the first mutant, and he's you know cybernetically enhanced himself, and he's got all these mutations. Rah, rah, rah. He has this team of the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse because he's a massive vegamaniac, and it's what is it? War, famine, death, and. Pestilence. And you and he gets different We're mutants to fill these roles. At one point, Wolverine was war, or uh, an archangel was death. Um, so I reckon that's where Wolverine's going to come into it here. All right. Hmm? Let's see. So you reckon Deadpool's going to be in that one? First up, we've lost contact. I don't know. Well, if that's the next X Men film, yeah. if they reckon they can get him in for Apocalypse, I just don't know where they'd put him because it's such yeah, I know, but it's such a huge change of tone to put Deadpool in something. You can't be taking the entire movie too seriously because as soon as Deadpool's in there, he's not going to take it seriously. No, he's you, not could gonna be, be... you could be taking it hell seriously, but imagine just like Wolverine <laughs> Wolverine walks into a bar to have a cigarette or to have a fucking cigar or something and Deadpool's sitting in the background in full uniform and he just looks at the camera and waves. 
<laughs> like, there's still a serious <laughs> moment. Yeah. But if you know you're looking for it, you've seen it, and it's just that you've immediately captured Deadpool. The yeah. fourth wall breaking. Yay! I really hope that's the reference. Like, I, I hope it's not a massive, like, speaking role or anything like that. I hope it's just... Yeah, you see him in the background and he's recognised that... Oh, I'm in a movie. Um, I'm going to do the... Sorry to cut you off. I'm going to do the main story here. I'm not actually going to do any of the side quests in that unless I have to. Oh, was that a side quest? No, it was getting me to... That's your select. You select anything that's actually happening that's active around the city. Oh, okay. So there's murders that are happening. Yeah. <coughs> which I was... I thought was a... Um... A call to a to the Hush comic book. Oh, but I don't wish to spoil too much. But it's not. I haven't finished it, so I don't know what it is. But I know it's not that. Yeah. Now. Well, yeah, because we, what we saw. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Why is hang on, hang on, stop? Why is the Riddler wearing a Hawaiian shirt? I thought it was pajamas, but it could very well be pajamas. But from here, it looks like he's on vacation. Well, he looks like a thin, um, fat guy from Jurassic Park. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We've got Donson. We've got Donson here. Batman. See? Watch this. Nobody cares. Gave you the slip. You this is brilliant. For His mouth's not moving. Fuck oh. you. <laughs> oh, you can come brilliant. back later and, like, do the pretend to throw a punch like that, and yeah. he just freaks the fuck out <laughs> and falls over. Fantastic. So good. Um, back Get to off the floor. Do some work. Sorry, back to Deadpool. Um, I read... Someone put up a Tumblr post on my Facebook about what the Deadpool, what they have Deadpool in the X-Men films as, and it should be, so he's completely aware it's a movie, but because it's only an M-rated film or whatever, they only get one use of the F-word, and he's spending the entire movie waiting for the perfect moment to use it, then Wolverine says it, and he just fucking loses his shit, like flips out, and, oh, I was kind of doing it, going off. I don't think, yeah, that is that is perfect Deadpool right there. That should be definitely be what it is. Which, which movie are you saying this should happen in? Or? Any uh, any X Men film. Any X Men. An X Men film where Deadpool is the, a character also, and he's waiting the entire time to use the F word, and then Wolverine just wastes it somewhere, and he's so fucking pissed because he wanted to be the one who says it. Yeah, did that cop almost hit you? Yeah, I nearly got run over by cars. Huh. That ended the game really quickly. Yeah, that's how the Batman <laughs> died. <laughs> hit and run accident. Officer Johnson, you know who you just ran over? He's Batman, you should have seen it coming, it not a, my it problem. Rodent. It was Whoa. This has really, this game, even this? though I'm at about oh. halfway through, has really tugged at my heartstrings. Yeah. A lot of things that happen and... Yeah. And even this, cool back to the 66 Batman series. Oh yeah, that's classic. What, with the switch and the bus? I have to... Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But he's, they've updated it. Oh, sick. So it's not the I button hidden first. away next to the fucking grandfather clock. Yeah. Wow. Frame rate fucking dips every so often. I don't know why yeah. it's doing that. It didn't do it the first time I played. Oh, you were playing it yesterday and it would pause every so often. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. scary because this... This game has actually crashed my PS4. Like, I've, oh, that's I've right. had this thing that. since probably about three months after the PS4 was out, sort of thing. Yeah. And it's never crashed. <laughs> to reduce the but this to its core fucking r like, rimmed it, really. It just fucked it. Jeez. What if we've been looking at this the wrong way? Instead of delicious. The content, what if it's we delicious, but split process. into two fucking words. In the background, find them. I don't know why. The reaction and that's a unique radiation spike. Okay, so hang on. You being a massive Batman fan, can you settle something for me? You've seen Gotham, right? The TV series. I've seen like six episodes and then I lost interest. Believe it or not. Oh wow. Um. So there's Barbara Gordon in that, and that's his wife. Yes. But Barbara Gordon in this is his daughter. Yes. I spoke to Dad. Explain. Well, Barbara was named after his first wife. Right. Okay. In that the makes story sense. where in the story where Barbara is Jim's daughter, because yeah. there's a lot where she's a cousin or a fucking whatever it is, and she just lives with him. Right. Um, she was named after Jim's first wife. Right. Okay. But there's always like some sort of Barbara Gordon at some point. Yes. I guess. Generally. Like there's always a Sid in Final Fantasy games. 
Jim. Yeah. We've got a way to find out where right. now it's working from. Thank God. What I don't. Do? Sometimes it's canon, ready. sometimes it's not. You know, like location, I've you know. read the right. Court of Owls story by Scott Snyder. Yeah. Okay. Fucking brilliant, brilliant series of comic books. The Oracle doesn't appear in any of that. Okay. Like it's just whoa. Books. The fuck up in there. Oh, I don't know. He didn't want to climb over some shit, so I just decided to keep tapping X until he did. <laughs> no, I'm not climbing. I'm not climbing. It. But, just jumps. You know, yeah. Uh, sorry, a quarter of hours. You see a glimpse of Red Hood, oh. Nightwing, Tim Drake. You know, all of them. Um. No, sorry. Hang on. I'll take that back because Batgirl is in it, so Barbara is there. So, but she's a glimpse just like Red Hood. So hang on. Sorry, I'll take that back. So there's some Barbaragorns that are Watchtowers, there's some that are... Some Barbaragorns that girls. are Oracles. Some Oracles, Barbaragorns right. that are still Batgirl. Um, I don't know right now because they've done the fucking Convergence or whatever it is. Oh, so yeah, they've thinned the herd for the umpteen millionth time. DC hit reboot again. Yeah. I don't know what's canon anymore or whether Batgirl's actually still alive. No. Yeah. But see, uh, see, I complain about DC rebooting again, but that's only because they've done it like four or five times. Marvel's just had its first major reboot, just yeah, like Secret just Wars. now Secret Wars. Although I saw one glimpse, like I've, I love Marvel, but I don't keep up with it mm. like, as much as I do Batman. Yeah. But the one scene I saw from Secret Wars was um, oh. you and I were talking about it yesterday. The Doctor Strange, Doctor Strange Punisher hybrid, yeah. kills the Hulk in two moves, and I'm just okay. Whoa. <laughs> now I'm reading Punisher. <laughs> yeah. No, it's like now I want to know about Doctor Strange because that was never a character that appeared on my radar before. Pretty much if there's ever... Oh, who who in the Marvel Universe could beat this character? The answer is almost always Doctor Strange. That's the level of character you're talking about. We had... was I was reading the thun, uh, initial of the Thunderbolts a while ago. And the Thunderbolts is um, the Wetworks team of the DC uh, Marvel Universe. So it's... You know, the people who go in aren't afraid to kill everyone. Suicide Squad. Pretty much, yeah. So yeah. it's Punisher, it's Elektra. The most recent incarnation was Punisher, Elektra, Deadpool, Red Hulk, and... No, that was it. Those four. Um, the Revengers. Pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. Um, and I think Mastermind came along for, for the ride a little bit. But yeah, there was a point where they were talking about having to neutralize Doctor Strange, and Deadpool's like, well, you know, let's just go in and take him out. Like, what's the big problem? Um, Mastermind goes, yeah, you've got like a 3.2% chance of that succeeding. And they go, why? Because it's Doctor Strange. <laughs> that was literally, word for word, the response he gave. And I'm pretty sure I picked up that inflection as well. Because it's Doctor Strange. Yeah. Like... That's that's the level of character you're dealing with with Doctor Strange. Sir, it's the Avengers. How long can we hold them? It's, it's the, the Avengers. <laughs> it's the Avengers. <laughs> now that was, here that becomes the most annoying fucking. You can tell. No, no offense to Rocksteady by any means. I love these Batman games, but you can tell this was built going. Oh, hang on, we've got the Batmobile. Well, let's build a whole gameplay mechanic around you having to drive it all the time. Yeah. You know, simple fucking things that you know Batman would have gadgets to to fucking do these things without having to get in a car. Um, do you want to show us what the Power Winch does in the next episode? I don't really want to use the Power Winch at all, but yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, if you like this video, give it a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to our channel, and we will be putting these up as we can. Yep, you'll see Batman take on little traits of the Man of Steel movie here. For no reason. Just fucking everything just, up. Just break everything.